on everybody welcome back to Grizzos cards today we're doing throwback thursday and we're going to be using a can opener to open some cards yes that's right a can opener let me show you what i got for this first installment of throwback thursday i have some three cans of 1998 pinnacle inside i picked these up off of ebay they probably average about five dollars each oh, i'm sorry you can't see big mac there let's scoot those back show you what we got uh, so these were first issued in 97. Uh, it was the first year for Pinnacle Inside. And I wasn't able to find any of those at a decent price. Seems like 98 was cheaper. So just give you a look at the cans here. Uh, does say adult super, open with adult supervision. We have a Cal Ripken. So got some product facts. So we get, there's one pack of 10 cards in each of these. And this one's a little bit beat up. We got Nomar Garcia Para. A little bit of rust on the top there. So I was reading these were discontinued after 98. Um, hobby shops had trouble. They didn't like stacking these on their shelves. And collectors, um, you know, keeping sealed cans. I guess there was people didn't like that cans were, the cards were never getting open <laughs> because they were sealed. So let's go ahead and pop into this first one hopefully there's no workplace injuries here on Grizzo's cards uh, but I decided to start doing throwback Thursdays nice sharp edges on that one oh man all right there's one down show you what we're looking at inside there there's one pack with Wade Boggs on the top Let's get into these other two. I hope this isn't painting somebody to see me open these cans, destroying these $5 value canisters that somebody's been <laughs> holding on to for the past 23 years. That one dropped down. Uh, so I forget, I think the base set is 150 cards. There's two insert sets, I believe. Sorry, this is probably terrible audio <laughs> of the can opener. These were actually a lot easier to get open than I originally expected. There's our third pack. We're not going to find any big rookies, is my understanding, for 98. Um, but still, pretty cool. Um, too big to get them all in this. <laughs> background there but yeah so I decided to do throwback Thursday I've been was buying a lot of retro stuff to use in my grizzle boxes that I use for giveaways and I decided I wanted to open up some myself so thought I'd start off these I thought about them I was like oh I remember those cards in the can let's rip into some of those and see what we can find so while I'm getting this first pack open if you're new here and especially if you like throwback cards I will be doing this every Thursday so make sure you hit that subscribe button I do giveaways every 50 subscribers. And if everybody can do me a huge favor, smash that like button for me. Really helps me out. So we got Charles Johnson, Tom Glavin, got some Hall of Famers here, Ruben Rivera, Carlos Delgado, Antone Williamson, Craig Biggio, stand up guys. So this is one of the inserts. This is Ken Griffey Jr. and. Randy Johnson. So it's kind of interesting if you can see there is the card moves a little bit there. Um, so I'm guessing you can combine these with other ones. So it says 4C and 4D. So that says A Rod. And there's Griffey. Um, interesting. So you combine these together with other cards. <laughs> really cool, random stuff. Uh, if there's anything you would like to see old school that you remember, something oddball, drop me a comment. Let me know what it is. I'll see if I can find some and we'll do it here on the channel. Jeff Abbott, Mike Cameron, and show off these cards. A great way to display your cards is by showing them off inside a pinnacle icon. Order an icon. 40 bucks plus 350 shipping and handling. Interesting. Or you can get a screw down pinnacle. <laughs> that's interesting. All right, so well, that's pretty cool getting that Griffey insert. Well, I guess half a Griffey. <laughs> Let's see if we can get some more of those and put them together. 
Jose Guillen. There's Juan Gonzalez. Andy Bennett, or Alan Bennett, sorry. Todd Green. Ryan McGuire. Fernando Tatis Sr. Hey, did we got another one? So maybe another one. There's we got Bernie Williams. And who's that? We got Brady Anderson. Is that Kenny Lofton? It looks like. Really weird. Really interesting cards. <laughs> Oops, I'm grabbing the wrong sleeves. I think I put that other one in a thick sleeve. Sorry, don't have my supplies ready to go. Uh, we'll, we'll set that to the side. <laughs> there. There's a Chipper Jones, a Ken Caminiti, and a Jarrett Wright. All right, last pack. Looks like we got Wade Boggs put on. Oh, we got some inside trivia. Right, see this? What slugger was Rafael Palmeiro's team, or was Rafael Palmeiro's teammate at Mississippi State? Albert Bell, Will Clark, Jeff Bagley, or Todd Hundley? Answer is Will Clark. Surprisingly, Reds pitcher, the Cowboy, Jeff Brantley, hit cleanup. Hit cleanup, wow, for the Bulldogs that year. All right, that's cool. Some fun trivia for you there. We got Wade Boggs putting on some sunscreen. Will the Thrill Clark, Desi Relaford, Jose Cruz Jr., the Crime Dog, Fred McGriff, Hideo Nomo. There's another stand up guy, so you must get one of these in every can. Um, so we got Larry Walker. I'm not sure who that is on the other side. Dante Bichette. Oh, let's just see here. Pretty. So if you had them all, you could put them together like that. And Bernie Williams is merging with that Rockies player. <laughs> so very cool, very random. Uh, we got some backwards cards here. Get that trivia here in a minute. We got Jeff Kent, Ivan Rodriguez, and Brady Anderson. So very cool. Uh, I think the highlight for me was we got half of a Ken Griffey Jr. Um, let's get the last trivia question here. Marlins rookie Mark Kotze was named college player of the year when he was playing for what school? UCLA, Cal State Fullerton, Texas, Tennessee. The answer is B, Cal State Fullerton. All right, let me know in the comments if you enjoyed this video, if you're looking forward to more Throwback Thursdays, or if there's anything you want to see. Appreciate you watching. We'll see you next time. Have a good one.